Hey there. Well, this is a response video, a, a quick response video. Now, uh, engineer Max Koshu just posted another beautiful electronics blog. You should go check out his channel. It's fun stuff. And he was uh, tearing down a pallet full of tech scopes and things that he had recently purchased because he is a, a tech nerd. And uh, kind of fun. Just a short video, but fun. So go and view it. But uh, he mentioned that uh, if anyone else has any tech stuff, well, he's interested. Well, I've got tech stuff I've got to get rid of. But unfortunately, there's an entire ocean between me and him. So I think shipping is not going to work too well. Anyway, I mentioned that I have some weird tech scopes. And here's one of them. This is a 545. And uh, in the comment, I actually said 535, but it's actually a 545. It's a weird rack mount one. And, well, as you can see, if you are a connoisseur of tech stuff, you can see this is definitely strange. Normally, when tech rack mounted or offered a rack mount system, they called it an RM something or another. In case of the uh, 545, I believe it would have been called RM45. And they would rearrange the panel a little bit. They kind of turn it 90 degrees, so it would take up a little less uh, rack space. Well, I've got a couple of these things. They're 545s, and they didn't do that. They, uh, as you can see, it, it's standard rack mount, and they made custom panels. I've actually got two of these, so it's not a one-off. And I did notice the serial numbers are off by just a few digits. The one we're looking at right now is... Can we zoom up in there? I think that's... There we go. 1763. So, uh... Yeah, they actually made a real metal panel. And it is actually also engraved, if you look at it. It's the standard artwork, and that is engraved. It's black wrinkle paint. Oh, and you can see here, apparently this belonged to Hazeltine at some point. And they actually painted with several colors. There's yellow, there's white, and there's even some red in here. Uh, although, one thing I noticed is on my other example, which is right behind me, yeah, I'm kind of crowded here in my junk piles, but uh, they didn't paint at all. Um... But yeah, they actually made custom panels that are the same layout, even for the plug-in, and uh, did a really nice job. Look at that. They even engraved the, uh, the logo there. Why? Who knows? I guess it was a custom job. Now, the interesting thing is... It's a plain old... It's a plain old tech scope. From the panel on back. There's nothing special about it. Just it has this, this thick uh, thick metal. Actually it's two sheets. It looks like a, a standard piece of metal and then a, uh, or a standard thickness rack uh, panel and a thin overlay. And then they've got this thing going on here which is uh, some sort of support. Oh and I did notice it also says USAF property. So yeah, government money. Government money. Apparently they they couldn't just buy the RM45s. They needed tech to uh, come up with this panel. And, uh, boy, did it probably cost us taxpayers a bunch of money. Uh, but, yeah, interesting. It's a standard 545, just with a strange, strange custom rack panel in gray wrinkle paint, engraved with all the proper things in the right place. I don't know, it just seems kind of dumb to me. You know, RM45s were stock items, and uh, I th at least I think there was an RM45. I know there was an RM35. Uh, and they take up less space. So, I don't know what the deal is. Anyway, one of these days i got to get rid of these things, because I like tech stuff, but, you know, it's I can't collect it all. So, uh, I don't know, someday these will go to a ham fest or something like that. Um, I got a lot of tech stuff, as you can see, 
There's a, I think that's a 545 as well, but this one's got a, that one's got a cool Western Electric logo on it. So, uh, yeah, I got to get rid of some of this tech stuff eventually because I don't really do much with it except for the actual tech scope that gets, well, used. So anyway, uh, Max, here it is. Well, here's one of them. The weird gray rack mount 545. If you want it, well, boy, would this thing cost you a bunch of money to ship overseas. <laughs> I don't even want to think about that. All right. Okay, well. See you guys later. Bye now.